Well, good morning from Key West, Florida, where events leading up to the commissioning of the USS Billings are now underway. On average, the U.S. Navy only commissions fewer than 10 ships a year. So having one named after Montana's largest city, well, it's a pretty big deal. Having a ship in the military, in the Navy, named after you, it, it, it doesn't happen to every single town. And we're one of the smallest towns that have had that, so it's, it's, it's an honor for Billings to have that. It's been a long journey for the USS Billings and its crew to finally get to this point. Construction on the ship began in 2014 in Marinette, Wisconsin. Her keel was laid down in 2015. Since its christening and launch in July of 2017, the ship has spent most of the past two years going through testing and trials before departing for Florida. It's also been a long wait for those doing the groundwork in Billings to make sure the commissioning is a success. We got involved actively about a year and a half ago getting ready for the commissioning and we've been working hard ever since then. As the namesake city, Billings will pick up a large part of the tab for the commissioning events taking place here over the next four days for the ship that bears its name. The USS Billings Commissioning Committee has been raising funds and support for most of the past two years. To have uh, uh, the ship sailing around the ocean and people say, well, what's, what's Billings? Where's Billings? What's Billings about? And to have our crew talking to people and telling them about it. That's why we want to interact so much with the crew as much as possible. The USS Billings is a new breed of warship known as a littoral combat ship. Despite being 10 stories high and longer than a football field, it's also fast and versatile and can travel near shore in shallow waters. And while its name will give all of Montana something to be proud of, it has special meaning to many of those Montanans who served in the Navy. I thought it was tremendously exciting. Um, and then when I became a part of it, it was even more exciting. Because like I said, as a, when I was in the Navy, not allowed on ships, and now I actually get to be a part of the USS Billings and the committee that we're doing all this stuff, this uh, to make sure that the commissioning goes off and all the Navy traditions are held to. Plus, we get great tours being the committee. We get a long, lengthy tour of the ship. I was in the Navy for 30 years, but I came back to Billings. And, and uh, you know, this is my home. And to have my home city recognized with the honor of a, of a naming of a ship, is, it's, it's, it's unbelievable. It really is. There are a number of receptions and events leading up to Saturday's commissioning. U.S. Senator John Tester will give the principal address. His wife, Sharla, is the ship's sponsor. We'll have much more all week from Key West, Florida. I'm Russ Riesinger reporting for MTN News.